Hello everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice delivering you the latest Manchester United news. Of course, first of all, before we do anything, make sure you subscribe, smash that like button and also press that notification bell. And remember to share because sharing Ivorian Spice is caring, guys. Before we get into it, remember, if you want to contribute to the channel to help improve the quality content of this channel, you can always click on the link description. Let's get straight into it because it's your latest Manchester United news. And here in this video, I'll be going through the situation between Cristiano Ronaldo and Harry Maguire, the captaincy battle, all the emotions, all the cultures, all the drama that you've been hearing so far throughout this past week. And it's been hell. It's been a lot, guys. But yes, this is what you'll be getting in today's video. I will go through what has been going on in dialogue and then give you my personal thoughts on the situation. But as always, let's get straight into it. As you know, guys, Cristiano Ronaldo and Harry Maguire, it has been alleged in, in the news so far, it's been documented that Cristiano Ronaldo and Harry Maguire have been having issues. How Cristiano Ronaldo himself is interested in picking up the captaincy. Uh, and of, on top of that, news has also been coming out, coming from Ralph Ragnar, how things has never happened. Let us let me take you guys straight to what's happened during the start of the week. There was news circulating that Cristiano Ronaldo has, has been interested in starting his own clique. And of course, people have been undermining Harry Maguire. Manchester United players in the background for the last couple of months. And I, and I know this has been happening. I'm very sure ever since Harry Maguire himself, Captain Slabed, has been appointed captain. Certain, certain players haven't been fond of it, haven't, not, haven't liked the idea. And for us Manchester United fans, we all see it, we all know it. Harry Maguire is not Captain Material. He is not Captain Material at all. He is not a Captain Philip. You get me? He's not the Somalian pirate that comes on and says, I'm the captain of this ship. Who's the captain? I'm the captain of the ship. That's Ronaldo, the Somalian pirate that comes on Captain Phillips' boat and says, who's the captain? I am the captain of this ship now. And rightly so. So what's been going on is from what we've been hearing from the media, especially Mark Rashford came out and defended the whole situation. It came out from Christian folks. Christian folks said that Ronaldo has been starting clicks, of course, interested in the captaincy ban. Harry Maguire has come out and denied the whole situation after there hasn't been a riffraff between him and Ronaldo regarding the captaincy ban. And of, on top of that, our, our manager, Ralph Ragnar himself, has come out and said that there's been no talks, no talks of regarding Harry Maguire and Christian Ronaldo regarding the captaincy ban. As of now, with Ralph Ragnar's press conference, he has confirmed that Harry Maguire, Captain Slabed, the fridge, a.k.a will be captain towards the end of the season, which is, is normal, it's fine, because you can't strip a captain of his captaincy bad in the middle of the season. It, it's too much. This ain't, this ain't Arsenal where you strip a bummer rank and give it to someone else. So, what's going on right now? Harry Maguire came out himself and denied that nothing has happened between him and Ronaldo. This is not true, uh, how they all get along and etc. Sometimes it makes sense, guys. The click situation, there's always going to be clicks. You, ev everyone there is an international player. They all come from different countries. So, of course, you'll gravitate to those who speak the same language. Ronaldo's Portuguese, Bruno's Portuguese, and also Teller speaks Portuguese, Fred speaks Portuguese. So you can understand you, you will want to chill with the people that you speak the same mother tongue as, which makes sense. They will always have clicks in every football club. It is normal. But at the same time, top football clubs have a unity and, and they're all together as a family. So far, in my own opinion, Captain Slabed himself, he is not deserving of the captaincy ban at all. Not at all. Well, Cristiano Ronaldo himself has just come in. It's an interesting question. Will Ronaldo remain for next season? We don't know, depending on where Manchester it finish. In my personal opinion, I definitely believe there's been some problems and some issues in the dressing room regarding the captaincy ban. And, and of course, we all remember one day a certain Marcus Rashford turned around and said, shut the F up, you effing knobhead, to his own captain. So to me, that says it all that Harry Maguire, Captain Slabhead, is not respected in the dressing room. And our captain himself, which I'm tired of him, which makes so much mistake, he is the leader and your own captain 
is your shittest player in the starting 11 that cost us goals. So it, I can understand and it makes absolute sense, sense that certain players are not with him. They don't want him as captain. He is not captain material, especially after when you sign for the club six months later, you're made captain. You should have just turned it down and said, you know what? Give it to someone that's been here for long that deserves it. But he didn't do that. It's not his fault. You get given the captain armband, you're not going to turn it down. You're a Man United fan at the end of the day. So there is no smoke without fire at the end of the day. So Cristiano Ronaldo, which if he has gone up to Harry Maguire and said, you know what? You are not the captain. You don't have the balls, the minerals, the liquid in your system to be captain of Manchester United. You don't even have the footballing heritage. You know, you're a four times relegated player. You know, you don't deserve to be Manchester United captain. And Manchester United captain sets the standard. And our captain hasn't been setting the standard for, since the start of the season. Harry Maguire has been poor so far. Ralph Ragnar has come out and said that he's, this, is, this is not true. But I don't believe it. I believe it's true. I believe it's true. I want to know what you guys think of the whole situation between Harry Maguire and Cristiano Ronaldo, whether it's true or not, um, and, and your thoughts on it. Was Ralph Ragnar speaking the truth? Was Mark Rashford as well speaking the truth when he outed um, Christian Falk? Because Christian Falk replied saying that, not true, Mark Rashford, you, you, you know the truth, which is true. They, they do know the truth, what's going on inside that dressing room. Because me, I'm tired. I'm tired of this EastEnders drama. I'm tired of the drama. I'm tired of every time I read something, there's always a doof, 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 doof moment. Like, there's a coronation. It's a... You get me? This ain't Hollyoaks. This is football. And us Manchester United fans are tired of the drama. We just want to enjoy football. But guys... Thank you for watching the whole entire video. I'd like to thank you. Remember to subscribe, smash that like button, and also press the notification bell and share because, of course, sharing I will inspire is caring. Remember to follow the socials. And as always, remember to keep it united. And remember to keep it red united. Peace out.